Hi everyone, my name is Ibel Gray Kantoma. I'm from Greatest Card Design Concept. This is actually my WhatsApp contact. You can reach me on this number or you can call me, okay? Uh, these are the list of softwares which we have covered on our YouTube channel. They are very, very much available on that channel. Go down below the description of this video. You'll find a link to that channel. Visit the channel and actually keep yourself busy, okay? Uh, today I'm going to be showing you great things on AutoCAD, okay? Uh, AutoCAD, uh, the always bring uh, a lot of improvement on AutoCAD yearly okay they release new uh, versions of uh, AutoCAD uh, yearly okay uh, so if you have AutoCAD from 2017 on your system uh, to 2021 which is actually uh, the latest uh, version of AutoCAD okay um, there are some great features that actually been added to it okay i have explained some of that uh, in my previous trainings okay which i explain how you can actually convert a pdf file okay uh to an autocad file if you have an autocad file which is in pdf uh you can instead of uh, using another software to actually convert usually formally we normally use other softwares to actually convert it to a dwg file uh, but now you can actually use AutoCAD directly uh, just to convert it immediately once you just import it and automatically it will give you the file you can be able to edit it you can be able to use it normally as an AutoCAD file you can actually design on it it maintains the layers and everything that has to do with the original design uh, that ha was created before converted to PDF okay if you already love what you're seeing make sure you like this video you give it a thumbs up okay subscribe to this channel uh it's 100 percent free you see the red button down below uh this video just look for that red button written subscribe click on it and you have subscribed already okay click on the bell icon so as to always get a notification whenever i post videos i post videos like this on a weekly sometimes on a daily so as to encourage as many that wants to have a deeper insight of design okay uh, now you can see on this window here uh, if I click on if I right click on this drawing you can see I can open a new for example if I click on new it's actually going to open a new window for us <coughs> okay but you can see the other files are still there uh, not affecting the other files you can see it has actually given it a name drawing 2 okay uh, if I right click on this as well and I click on open it's actually go, going to open that for me okay if you like to as read only uh, because the reason why it's asking me if I want to open this as read only is because i already have this file opened on my system okay on this system already so there, there will be no need for me opening it i just wanted to explain that for us right now okay so if i double click on it i can come back to this you can see this is actually another drawing okay now uh if you are used to using uh 2000 and um 2007 for example uh, you, you have to go to window and then you switch window uh, you can see this is actually much more easier for you to actually switch move from one uh, design open on your system to another design okay on your system okay um, so here now uh, if I right click again you can see I can save this drawing and then you can see save all you know i have three windows opened i have this i have this and i have uh, the third one here so it's going to save all of these drawings for me okay it's going to save all simultaneously and then if i click on close it's actually going to close this particular file which i i right clicked on and if i click on close all it's actually going to close the whole uh, software itself which is the AutoCAD itself is going to close it all and then if I close all other drawings it's actually going to close um, sorry if I close all it's going to close the whole drawings on that are on uh, opened on the system okay but if I 
close all other drawings it's going to close other drawings but it's actually going to leave this particular uh drawing for me okay uh if i copy a uh, full file path okay now uh it's actually going to copy the uh, directory of uh, this file for me okay let me explain that okay if I copy click on copy full file path I just did that and then if I right click here and then uh, I come to clipboard and I click on paste and I click here now you can see it's going to show us the directory of this so uh, that is just what we have copied okay so this file is actually on user is on desktop it's on gray which is my name is on desktop engineer Raj which is the folder okay and then the name of the file is church design okay that's just the directory of uh, this file okay itself and then if I if I right click on this and I click on open file location instead of looking for the file and its location maybe you have forgotten where you have actually placed that file but the file is actually open on your system maybe you just want to see the location of that file if I click on that open file location it's actually going to take me to the location of uh, this file directly on my system okay still loading okay good now you can see it has taken me back to the directory of this file okay um, so that is that well explained okay uh, I hope we understand all of this if I click on close it closes this if I save as I can save this file as Okay. so I'm not going to save us and then I can save the file I can, I can save all okay uh, if you love what you're seeing make sure you give it a thumbs up subscribe to this channel it's actually free click on the bell icon so as to get a notification whenever I post videos I post videos like this on the weekly sometimes on the daily so as to encourage as many that wants to have a deeper insight of the site make sure that you stay safe and make sure that you actually Steve.